Local sports from KYMA News 11. All right, we're back here at Warren Field. I'm very privileged to be joined by Brawley Wildcats head football coach John Self. And coach, obviously, you had a very tough schedule. You had Scripps Ranch, you had Valley Center, you had Modern Day Catholic, and then you had a five game winning streak that you just rolled up going into tonight. And I know we talked about this before, but it just looms on my mind in regards to how that tough schedule seems to be paying off right now. Yeah, it paid off. Uh, you know, we got to see some, some teams that we don't normally play early in the season and work out some kinks. And, you know, coming into this five game winning streak, I think we played some, some pretty quality football. Okay. And speaking of quality football, we'll start with your offense. I know you often hear about, you know, Isaiah Young, the running back, Ethan Gutierrez, the quarterback, and those guys obviously deserve the headlines. But I, I want to give some love to the offensive line. These guys really stepped up their game. Talk about their development and their progress, especially going into tonight's battle. Yeah, the, I mean, they, they, they've they come a long way. You know, their pass pro is excellent. They're, they're doing a good block, uh, job on run blocking. And, uh, you know, some of the kids hadn't played since their freshman year because of the pandemic, and they've really stepped up and, and are picking their game up every week. All right. Well, you know, speaking of picking the game up, you aren't the only ones playing really good football right now. Imperials won their last three, but you've had the edge on them over the last five seasons. Talk about, you know, just what concerns you about them considering they've won three in a row and, and they seem to be picking up momentum as well. Oh, exactly. They, they have momentum coming into this game and we're looking forward to a very spirited game with them. Okay, very good. And, you know, we notice the weather elements not often play a factor in the desert southwest. In this game, it might a little bit with the wind. Do you have to kind of alter your game planning a little bit? I know you're a run first game, but a team, but, you know, the kicking game obviously affected as well. No, I don't think I don't think we'll alter anything. We'll just keep playing the way we play and and uh, you know play hard. Okay, very good. And as far as special teams is concerned, they don't get enough love either. And we're going to talk about it right now. Kind of assess the special teams matchup between your Wildcats and the Tigers tonight. Um, you know, our special teams have played well all year, and and I think that's been you know changing field position has been a, a big part of of what we've done this year and, and giving ourselves some short fields. So. Yeah, we've done well on it, and you know, Imperial's, Imperial's been able to capitalize on some of that themselves. Okay, and finally, give me the three keys to a Wildcat victory tonight, keeping that winning streak going at six. I think just playing hard, uh, playing tough, and playing consistent. All right, well, Coach, thank you very much. We wish you the very best tonight. And, of course, you can catch tonight's marquee matchup highlights right here on Friday Night Lights, right after Nightside between the Wildcats and the Imperial Tigers. Coach, what do you want to say? One last word. Go Wildcats. All right, Let's thank you very go. much, Coach. All right, you know, we're really pumped, Adonis. We really are, so oh, can't wait for tonight.